Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Apollo IO and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you manually add one contact into your Apollo IO? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to manually add one of your contacts into Apollo IO? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know that sometimes you meet people organically and you want to set them up into your funnels in Apollo IO. So you have to manually enter them in. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Apollo IO account. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my Apollo IO and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to manually enter one person into your Apollo IO, here on the left side, you're going to click on prospect. Okay, so once you do that, you will see all of your prospects or customers inside Apollo IO. However, to manually add one person, click here on the top right, import, and then you want to click on this one, single contact. CSV is going to be if you're uploading a list. Okay, so here's where you can go ahead and enter a contact. So you can go ahead and enter in their name. So let's say John Doe, you can go ahead and enter in their email. All right, and we can put their job title here. We can put their company name. Okay, here you can go ahead and tag them. So maybe they are cold, replied, interested. So let's do interested. You can put their company phone number, any notes about this particular customer. Good Chinese food. Okay, you can put their LinkedIn and location. Let's go ahead and do San Jose. Okay, so that looks pretty good. So I'm gonna click on save contact. Okay, now we have added in our contact one by one. So if you're gonna add them into one of your funnels or into a sequence, you can go ahead and click right here or you can send them an email directly from here. And then if ever you need to contact them, you can just show up right here on prospect. All right, once we're here in prospect, you wanna click here on save. Okay, so there is our manual contact that we added in. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to manually add one contact into your Apollo IO, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.